What's going on gamers? Today, we're going to go over how to connect to your server with an FTP client and our top five programs we recommend for you to manage your server files. Before we get into this tutorial, don't forget to give this video a like, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you can get notified of every new tutorial we upload, just like this one. Managing server files in a fast and efficient manner is key to running a successful server. Whether you need to upload, or download, or manually manage your files that you'd like to use, an FTP client is the best way to do it. FTP clients are just a more advanced version of the Apex FTP on your main server panel. When you use an FTP program to connect to your server, you use it to perform more advanced tasks than your regular ones would allow you to. Most of these programs work the same way, but they just look different. Luckily, this means that once you learn how to use one, you know how to use them all. What you're going to go ahead and do once you download and install these programs is you're going to go ahead and open up your program. Once your program is opened up, you're going to go ahead and go to the login section. This is where you're going to be putting in your host, your username, your password, and your port. Once you have this info, go ahead and on your program, enter in each field. For the host, enter your host name from your Apex FTP file access login page and your username and your password and your port, and make sure that it's all transferred over. Host to host, username to username, password to password, and port to port. It should tell you that you are connected, but the best way to tell that you are connected is just to make sure that all of your files match up on your server. If these files match up, then you'll know that you'll have successfully connected your server to your FTP program. Our first program is FileZilla. FileZilla is one of the most popular and efficient FTP programs out there. We use this program at Apex Hosting every day and we highly recommend it. There are lots of features that FileZilla has. Some of these include bigger and more transferable speed limits, more availability in languages, and it's cross-platform. FileZilla is able to use in Windows, Mac, and Linux. To begin, all you need to use are the quick connect fields at the top of the page. Another extremely popular option for an FTP client is CyberDuck. With CyberDuck, you can connect to many different storage solutions this includes FTP, Google Drive, Dropbox, and more. If you need to download your files straight to your Google Files, you can do just that. CyberDuck, like all of these programs that we're mentioning, is free. But this one is open source. And if you want to know where you can install this program, you can install it for Windows and Mac. To begin, all you need to do is click on Open Connection and enter your FTP info. Win SCP is a lot like these other programs, but it does have some other cool stuff, like its light interface, transfer queues, master passwords, and file inclusion. It kind of looks like FileZilla, but it's a free alternative for those with the previous FileZilla experience. Unlike some of these other programs, Win SCP is only available on Windows, but you can use it the same way like you use other FTP programs. All you need to do is click on Info, Create New Session, and then Connect. Core FTP LE is an other free program, and it's also lightweight. This secure FTP client is going to be able to connect fast, easy, and reliably. Some of the main features of Core FTP LE are site-to-site -site transfers, drag and drop, browser integration, and similarly to WinSCP, you can use Core FTP LE on Windows. To begin, all you need to do is click 
on Site Manager at the top and Add Details. With Commander 1, you can easily and securely transfer files off of your server using a Mac device. Commander 1 is like the other programs on this list, but it has a huge amount of features such as file support, operations queue, unlimited tabs, and full font and color customization. This program is perfect for macOS because it's only compatible for macOS. To start, all you need to do is click on your connections manager at the top right of the toolbar, press FTP, and then enter in your server details. Overall, all of these external NTP programs behave pretty similarly to each other, but each one has their own slight differences in design and features. Because of their simplicity, transferring from one FTP program to another is as simple as locating the login info. Whether you're using one for ease of access or to do more advanced file adjustments, we highly recommend using an external FTP program to keep your server running smooth and easy. Well folks, that's all we've got for you today. And as always, we hope you have lots of fun. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more great content like this, then subscribe or click these videos. Until next time, gamers.